Hello, welcome to this channel. It's a beautiful day here in Florida, and today you're gonna learn about backlight compensation. My name is Claudemir Martins, I'm your teacher. Don't forget to click the link in your description, download your guide, right? And also don't forget to subscribe to this channel, leave the thumbs up and your comments, and hit the bell notification so you can receive more information about videos like this one. Okay, so let's move on here to backlight compensation. When you have an image like that, where there is some dark areas. As you can see here, there's a dark corner here, a dark corner here again, and you have the image here that's not clear enough, that's not, not illuminated enough, so you can't see what's going on here, right? So you need to correct that, and you have some features on your camera that can do that for you. So what you're gonna do is use the BLC or the backlight compensation so your camera can receive more light. So more light comes to the sensor, hit the sensor, and then you see a clear picture here inside. But look, you, you're gonna to miss what's happening there outside, okay? So suppose you don't care. You don't care what's going on outside. You only care about what's inside this object, for example, or, or some people there around here inside and then you use BLC. If you care about both, if you care about indoors and outdoors, you need to use WDR. That's another technology I already talked here in other videos. So it's a different one, right? This one is just to prioritize something, let's say something that is inside here. You can use BLC in the whole area here in the picture, or you can select a specific area where you can see the object or the people that are inside. Okay, so BLC, very good. And also you can use a different technology that's called Highlight Compensation, HLC. And that's used for cars and for glares, things like that. As you can see here, there's a car and there's an excess of light here and you're gonna cover this with a mask. So the Highlight Compensation, gives you a dynamic mask that goes here in this light. So you get an image like this one, right? So as you can see here, now you can see the car and now can, you can also see the license plate. That's much, much better. Let's say you wanna recognize the license plate. You have a software for that, or you need to recognize the image with license plate. You need to use this feature with highlight compensation that works pretty fine, okay? So you can find this in professional cameras and then you can use the way you want to so you can have better quality, right? And guys, don't forget to learn more here in this channel by looking at other videos and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave your thumbs up and hit the bell notification, okay? See you in the next video.